What's up, friends of the good mood? This is Manny, and welcome to a fun comparison gameplay here with a vortex on two different robots, the leech and the spectre. Which one of these two is the better fun machine with these two weapons here? Uh, we have lockdown ammo equipped, so we can actually go and have even more fun by being able to lock people down. Let's activate some boosters for the duration of this video just to have the maximum damage with this trolling setup here. Jump into some uh, beacon rush and then maybe a free for all battle and see how these things do. Oh, if that's not one of the best maps for Vortex play, then I don't know what is, guys. Let's go and have some fun, starting with, with a Spectre, okay? And afterwards, we're gonna get the into into the leech uh, that has the same firepower, uh, but much more survivability with its uh, resistance. Oh my gosh, am I? Is this the max walking speed of the Spectre now, dude? This thing was so much faster back when it was the Meta machine. Okay, is he flying? I think he might might be. Boom! <laughs> Dude, I think this could have been an Aoguang or something like this. This may have actually been like an Aoguang, and I completely obliterated him like one hit. Alright, this guy right there. Look, look. And... Boom! That's a Falcon, man! That's a Falcon! And he just got hit while his resistance, aka pants, were down, man. That sucks so hard for him. Boom, 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 boom. How am I getting hit? Ah, from behind. Okay. Is that a leech? It is a leech. And he's now leeching. Okay, there is a Rogat, uh, uh, Galahad, I mean. Oh, zero damage! Whoa! Zero damage is the best. I love when I do zero damage. So, could somebody just get his last stand activated already? Okay, last stand is ticking. Oh my god. Now he needs. Okay, now he's coming out of this with the full leech ability again. Somebody blocked my vortex. Okay. Okay, so. How is he still alive? I don't get this. Okay, here he comes. That was to expect. So. Um, I'm still I'm still here. I'm still good. And look at this. Look at this. Boom. Bam. Down to last stand in almost one hit. Alright, so that was a good thing. He, he just completely killed himself. Boom! This guy just died almost from the hit. Uh, and although we're uh, we're losing a few beacons, uh, we're also gaining a beacon on the other side, it seems. Okay, this guy's a one-shot. Here we go. Boom. Nope, not a one-shot. Almost one-shot. Okay. Hit and boom hit. Yep, that's a lot of damage right there. Boom, boom. Even with his resistance thing going. Boom. <laughs> Complete Falcon insta whoop. And you have a lot more survivability here in this thing. Nothing can just take you oh, out yeah. immediately. That's a nice map for free for all, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, lots of cover where enemies feel safe behind and are in fact not. So let's try and make that make that you make use of that, okay? This guy, for example, is coming around the corner and boom! Already lost 50% of his health. Now he's mad. Now he's mad. Okay. He's gonna come around. I'm trying to lock him. Okay, it didn't work, but uh, he's gonna be locked once he lands, and fire. Boom! What? Oh, the resistance! Okay, I forgot about the resistance that you have when you fly up. Okay, but now it's ending for you. Boom! That was a full invader, ladies and gentlemen. So what is this guy gonna do? Two, three, one, and boom! My kill! Oh no, that's a falcon. Oh boy, that's a falcon. That's a lot of HP that we have to take down here. Fire, lockdown, and fire. Okay, they're both coming for us. I'm gonna use this here. Okay, thankfully the falcon turned around and went for the other guy. 
That's good for me. I'm keeping a rocket in. So once the last stand is gone, two, three, four, that's it. Boom, boom. My kill. All right. Thank you, Falcon, for giving me that kill for free. Now I'm going to lock this guy with one rocket. I'm going to activate my resistance, and I'm going to hit him with everything I've got. Boom. Which is next to nothing, considering this is a traditionalist Falcon. He's just not taking any damage, man. Get it. You're not going to hurt him. All right, but this guy maybe. Fire. Boom. <laughs> yep. Whatever this thing is, I was able to hurt it quite a bit. Okay, it's an Ares. I'm inside his shield. And boom. Vortex uppercut. That's what we call that. Okay, this guy, he's, he feels safe. And boom. Not safe, sir. Not safe. Okay, here comes the Falcon. He's still on me. Okay, he's gonna shield. Oh, he gonna, he's gonna shield too late. That's interesting. The Falcon actually ignores me. That's interesting, too. Boom, boom, boom. Wow, wow! Look at that Fel Fenrir, man. That Fenrir just took so much damage. Fire, fire. Boom, my kill. Nice. Uh oh. Lockdown ammo here. Oh, he's got. Wait, what? All of a sudden, he has the resistance against that? Okay, fire. Boom. Fire. And. Yes, my kill. Nice. So far, I've gotten pretty much every kill there was to get. Uh oh. I'm done. Okay. I hit this guy, I think, one more time. So let's go into the Spectre. Yeah, I think I hit him. Look, he, he lost a little bit of health. And boom. <laughs> Dude, it does, I don't think it matters much if you run it on a Spectre or on a Leech. The damage output is impressive no matter what you'd pick. However, the Leech will stay alive for much longer. But the uh, the guy who has the, the Spectre has this here. Lockdown and fire. Boom. Look at that monstrous hit that he just took from the lockdown combo. And fire. Boom and boom. So he's going to try and jump on us now. But I also have my ability ready soon. My stealth jump. Okay, he's, he's going to land and fire. Perfectly timed with the landing so that he takes the maximum damage. You see, even a freaking invader can't take that much damage. One guy, one shot for lockdown, one for kill. And boom. Nice. See that? Even the freaking... Where is this guy? Okay. Let's try and do some damage before we die. Come on. Not sure if it counted. Enemy 5. No, enemy 5. Look, full health. It didn't count anymore. I don't have quantum radar. That's the problem that we have right now. With quantum radar, I could be doing a lot more. But the lockdown ammo is helping me a lot against invaders and stuff like this. Okay, one shot to lock and one to kill. Nope, he managed to walk away. Oh, yeah, it was a decent hit. You see this? It was actually a decent hit that he just took. He's gonna fly again. This guy is my target. Fire. And... Wow, okay. Okay, it wasn't too bad. Decent amount of damage. He's gonna activate his shield in a second. Okay, fire. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, every damage that they are doing to me now is going to go for him. I'm trying to sneak one in. You saw this here? I was trying to be very tricky with with sending them in every little direction. To try and sneak one one little side hit, side hit in there. Fire. They're, he's not going to expect that. Oh, he did expect that, actually. Interesting. It's a shock train player. Okay. Okay. A lock hit would be good for him. If we could get him locked. Because that would mean he's going to die from the next one. Okay. Fire one with lock and fire the next ones. Boom and boom. <laughs> we would have never been able to kill that specter without the lockdown ammo here. The first shot needed to lock him so that the, the other shots can come in and deal the real damage. 
That's a bulwark, okay? I thought it was an Auchun. Then I realized he has a shield. So, even in free for all, it is still a very viable setup. This guy may not realize. Oh, he does realize, yeah. Fire, fire. Boom, boom. There is his shield. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try and steal this kill as soon as I can. Fire, and that's it. Boom! My kill, nice. So, and while this guy is no doubt going to try and catch me now... Lockdown ammo one... F oh, not bam! The next one, boom! Better hit afterwards. However, you see even the full perfect hits. They're just too weak. They're just not really strong enough. Fire and fire, boom! The damage just isn't good enough. And he's not so slow that he will never catch up to us. He can eventually catch up. Fire, let's see if we can kill him. Boom, yep, we could. The good thing is we have the anti-control going here. Uh, 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 not anti-control, we have... Oh, he's got... I'm, surpri I'm so surprised when I see him suddenly have anti-control. Because I thought he didn't have that, and all of a sudden he does. Fire, and boom. You see, slowly but surely, he does take a lot of damage from that. I'm gonna wait for the lockdown ammo here. Okay, he's locked now. And I'm gonna try and escape. Hopefully the others are fighting each other too. They are a little bit, but not a lot. Corner shooting me, okay. Full hit. And now when his start fire starts again, boom, another full hit. He's almost done now. But he is also regenerating his health. He's locked. No, he was not locked. Damn it. He did not get locked. I need to get it escape here really quickly. This guy's a quick kill, isn't he? Yeah. He was an easy kill. Why did I not take him out sooner? Okay, now I have the resistance back. Unfortunately, I don't have lockdown ammo, so I'm going to keep one of my rockets so I can keep him locked for a second here. Fire. Okay, he's going to be locked now. Very important, that buys me a few extra, extra seconds. Okay, and fire. Boom. Even the traditionalist Falcon gets eventually destroyed uh, by the leech with um, with his stuff here. And boom. Uh-oh. He's... He oh no, he's healing again. I didn't account for this, take into account the healing that he would have. And now he has the thing. Uh-oh. We need one more perfect hit. A perfect hit. I'm not sure if we're gonna get it. And we're losing weapons. Ah, okay. He managed to do it in time. At the last possible second, he managed to do it. And that was only my mistake. I thought I would. I have him now. And then he triggered the healing and it destroyed everything. Okay, bam. Bam, bam. Very little damage, but that's how it goes against a fast robot. Fast robots, you can't hit very well with, uh, obviously, with these vortex and stuff. But this guy, for example, look at this, and boom! <laughs> that invader just ate some damage right there, man. And now he wants to, ta to, uh, to take revenge on it. And I'm blocking the damage here, and boom! <laughs> vortex uppercut, man. That is what we do. That was a nice vortex uppercut. And there is an, uh, what's it, a Lancelot? Boom, 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 boom. There goes the Lancelot. And even when we're being attacked by jumping invaders, we don't have to hide, we don't have to be super careful. Uh, because we have the, the means to survive with the resistance. <laughs> Man, this guy behind me, he just couldn't pass me. He just got stuck at me forever. He was quite attached to me. <laughs> so, um... All right, look at this. Look at this. Look at this guy. And fire. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. That was perfectly timed from him. 
I thought I was gonna get him so hard with this. Unfortunately, it didn't work. I thought he comes out and has no shield, but obviously a nemesis will always have the shield after the phase shift. So, um, ah, hello. Oh no, wait, and fire. Boom. <laughs> I'm sure he wanted to stealth jump at some point, but that stealth jump was no longer available after his robot was destroyed. So what do we have? We have a hover. And we have an Aochun, it seems. Hover and Aochun. Problem is I can't catch any of them right now. Uh, okay, there is a lot of firepower underneath that roof. There is a ridiculous amount of firepower under that roof. Okay, he can't hit me right now. Lockdown ammo here. Boom, and... Boom, okay. Well, that is it for me now, because I'm being attacked by four people, and I'm locked down at the same time. Okay, and there is the fifth guy. The fifth guy is already ready for it. And boom. So there goes this guy, but this is in... I mean, what am I supposed to do? There's just way too much going on right now. Okay, and fire. Boom. Wow, man. A full Inquisitor just instantly snapped. Let's get back into safety if possible here. And fire. Kill. Boom. So, while we're reloading, we're waiting for this Ares here to lose its, uh, its bus. And fire. Boom. Almost done and done. I don't know how in the world he locked me down so quick, but... It's not, it's possible. It, uh, it does happen from time to time. Yeah, so another successful Vortex fun. Uh, let's see how much di we did. We, we did do some, some damage. Of course, again, not scoring first, but that's not important when you're running Vortex. When you run Vortex, it's about having the maximum amount of fun. And you always succeed in having so, that. And the Ares is not running the shield, is he? He is, he was. Was he running? I don't understand. I don't know if he was running the shield or not. And boom, and boom, full high chi done. Because he was completely stationary right there. Shouldn't have done that, man. Okay, I got this beacon back with the leech while defending it the other side as well. Boom. Uh, dang it, okay. Okay, do your damage to me. I'm being leeched from someone else, too. That's interesting. Fire. Boom. Uh, okay, he's leeching right now. I need to get his last stand re released. There is his last stand gone. And fire. And kill. Boom. Nice. Alright, so. Once this guy's shield drops... Fire. Boom. Perfect hit, man. Perfect hit. Come on, give me everything you've got, because I'm leeching at the other dude right now. Fire, and bye-bye. Boom. <laughs> this is what I meant with Power Plant, man. This map is really good for Vortex. People love to stay behind cover and, and hide from the Vortex, but they can't. Because it's coming in from above and ignoring their, their positioning and their cover. So, lockdown ammo here. Bam. And, oh, can't lock. Okay, let's see if I can lock him here. Also can't lock him. Wow, interesting. Okay, nobody's lockable because they all run the anti-control. Boom, and boom. No last stand release. Damn it. That was very important. It would have been very important to get his last stand. It's not coming around the corner. It's standing there. This guy is standing. And... Boom! <laughs> oh, man. The, the fun thing is, very often you don't even know what you just killed, right? You have no idea. It could be anything. Fire, and... Boom! That guy just took a lot of damage. And we have somebody also with Vortex here. Okay, he's locked! Oh my god, that's gonna be good. Boom! You saw this hit? That was a massive hit. 
And jump and fire. And perfect trigger with a landing. Boom. Extra damage. And he you see him? He's trying to stay in this in this perfect 350 meter weapons range. So he can keep hitting me. Let's see, let's see, he's coming out. Fire. And boom. Oh <laughs> man! Did you see the damage that he just took from this? Dude, that was ridiculous. He just took so much damage. And ah, okay, he went away. Oh no. When did this guy come up here? Boom! There goes almost his entire last stand. Uh, his entire robot almost. So this guy wants to capture the beacon. <laughs> he blocked him in midair. He blocked him perfectly in midair. Fire, fire, fire. Bam, 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 bam. So there goes, there goes the full uh, specter. He's walking back down into safety. Underneath the roof? Is he under the roof? Yeah, he is. Yeah, but they are losing. They're losing the map pretty hard right now. So... Not too much of a chance for them at this moment. Locking on to somebody. So we can instantly switch to this guy. Lock down ammo and bye-bye. Boom. Ah, and he has another one. It wouldn't be a good it wouldn't be him if he didn't have another one of those things sitting around. And he's not coming all the way here, which is good. Okay, here we go. And boom, good hit. Good hit. Now I'm in safety and he is not. Although Arguably, this is not safety for very lo much longer. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. And as you see right here, no matter where I go and what I do, I'm in a really bad spot. Fire. Boom. Wow, I almost took down this entire freaking uh, Fenrir here right in front of us. Although I don't think we're going to survive for another two seconds. Are we? Yeah, we are. Okay, and fire. Boom! And I took it with me! Unbelievable, dude! Unbelievable that I got this guy. Okay, I just used my Quantum Raider completely for no reason there. Okay, we have him locked. He's not locking me down right now. Okay, we have a Trident Fury or something standing behind us. And it seems like the enemy team is non-stop having robots. Like, they still have stuff. They still have robots everywhere. That's unbelievable. If that's the last robot, then I have a chance here. If I lock him... I can't lock him. He's actually capping the beacon at the same time as he's... Uh, and he got, he got it. He got the beacon. Unbelievable. If he has another robot, it's over. It's game over when he has another robot. If he doesn't have another robot, I'm good. Okay. He was actually able to cap the beacon and be safe from me at the same time because of that stupid rock. But I got him then. <laughs> I turned the entire match around in a 3 on 1 near the end. Oh my god, can I please just get into the stats? Thank you. So, uh, not a bad match. Not a bad match but at all. But you saw, even in free fall, this setup is actually, these setups are actually working even in free fall. Although, I still say that normally if you want to win free fall, you go with different setups. Things that kill fast and reliable. These things are a little bit less reliable, um, but they're fun. And that's what matters, right? So, um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and comment down below. And if you haven't already, hit subscribe as brutal as a man can hit for more. Thanks for bearing with me. You guys are awesome as always. Money Gaming signing off. Bye-bye.